Now we come to a game called Psychiatrist, and this will feature Josie Lawrence as a rather interesting psychiatrist. She's going to sit on a stool and have a stool for her patient. And what's going to happen is the patient is going to arrive and sing his symptoms uh, to Josie, and Josie is going to sing some sort of advice or, or cure. So Greg and Mike are going to be the patients in this. Um, so first of all, Greg, if you'd like to come on, can we think of something that Greg's uh, afraid of? He's got a, an un... A friend of women. Yes, all right. Well, maybe, maybe you know Greg. So let's... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so there you are. You're well, sick. you do, don't you, Claude? <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes, ra rather too well for my own taste. Oh but my. Uh, where you go, you're frightened of women, scared of women. I'm actually going to sing your symptoms to Joseph. She'll sing you a cure. Please, please. Excuse me, doctor. Don't be frightened. Okay. Well, ever since I was young, I spent a lot of time alone. Other kids would go out on dates, but I'd just sit at home. It wasn't that I wasn't social. It wasn't that I didn't care. I just couldn't meet people who had longer hair. That might be bad for you. I'm sure it made you kind of creepy. It was a bummer. Because there was a lot of men with long hair in the days of the hippies. But this tale is common, as common as any other. The reason you're frightened of females is because you're frightened of your mother. Now I know that women scare you and they make your heart a racing. But be off with you, don't bother me anymore, or I will bash your face in. Very good, very good indeed. Um, so... So we want something for uh, Mike now. Uh, not that something he's afraid of, maybe something he's unnaturally in love with or obsessed by. Poodles. Poodles. That's a great one. Poodles. Poodles is a type of dog we have in England, and uh, maybe you have them over here as well. I don't know. <clears throat> yes, we do. Okay, where you go. You're obsessed with poodles. Tell me about your problem. <laughs> They're small, and they're cut really funny. They bark, and their nose and eyes are runny. When they go walking on the street, their little forefeet, toenails I hear in meat, I can't stand them, they scare me. Doodles! Those nasty poodles! I get this problem a lot of times. I know you're a real mean tripper. It's because you hate the poodles, especially the ones with the really strange clipper. Never go out into the street. Never go in the smog. Uh -huh. Never go near the poodle. They're a funny kind of dog. Oh, let me give you these pills, my boy. They'll help with the whole caboodle. And stay away from the silly women that always have a poodle. Very good, very good. Um, very good. Right, excellent.